Bonadar Pau, it's a great pleasure to be addressing you today at this virtual conference. We have all had to learn to do things differently over the past few months and a virtual conference is certainly one of them. We cannot underestimate the impact that the COVID pandemic has had on us all. Leaders especially have had to adapt and change approaches very quickly. Some of it for the better, some of it not so much. You have also had to lead in different ways, working and coping with the stresses and strains that this pandemic has really thrown at us. Yet, you have all been a brilliant and I cannot thank you enough on how well you have not only supported learners, but also the parents and communities that each one of you serve. At the beginning of this outbreak, the National Academy conducted a survey into well-being, and I'm sure that you will hear a lot more about that today. It was conducted during the early stages of the initial lockdown, and it showed leaders in schools were particularly impacted by stress and anxiety. This work now forms part of what the Academy is doing to develop an all-whale strategy for the well-being of educational leaders. And the Welsh Government, well, we've also been listening to messages coming from you by introducing a number of measures to help mitigate some of those causes of the stress and anxiety. To support you during these unprecedented times, we've introduced a number of support programmes. We've taken away some of the reporting requirements and we have supported the new inspection processes, to mention just a few. And we, we will continue to work with you to ensure each and every one of you are able to succeed. We will also be undertaking a review of support for leaders and the provision that's on offer to ensure that together we can identify what support is currently available, who does what, and to ensure that the support you need now and in the future is accessible to you and of the highest quality. This, however, is just part of the story and we will continue to ensure that all leaders, staff and pupils can continue to reach their full potential. The National Academy will therefore continue to work with partners to ensure that we have that coherent and cohesive approach to leadership uh, well-being. It will convene a working group of the middle tier to ensure that all parties can work together for you and that the support offered is better coordinated and more appropriate. The Academy has come a long way since its conception in 2016. Addressing wellbeing issues and supporting heads is just some of the work that it has been asked to do. It has in its short existence undergone a lot of change and I want to wish Tegwin and her team the very best of luck moving forward. And I hope that you as leaders will continue to work with Tegwin and the team to ensure that leaders in Wales are not only supported, but also enabled to make a real difference. I hope that you enjoy this conference. You will hear from a range of speakers today, as well as hearing directly from a number of practitioners. And that I hope that you take away with you not just a good feeling, but that you build on your knowledge of what is out there for you, and that together we can achieve even more. As I said, we cannot underestimate how working together we can achieve more even if we have to currently do that in a very, very different way. I wish you all well and I hope you enjoy the experience. Poor Blokpaub.